divided into two kingdoms. There was Camelot, and then there was where I lived. Stay behind the red line until you are clear. Only those with work pieces for Camelot will be allowed to pass. Which we call Nottingham. As in not gated, not rich, not popular, not cool. They didn't let us into their kingdom, and they rarely sullied themselves by venturing into ours. On the day before my 18th birthday, a terrible thought drifted into my head. What if I remained a crusty nobody for what little remained of my high school life? My school is one of those where at least 96% of the girls were in the haughty or high haughty bracket, and most of the guys looked like they wandered out of an Abercrombie and Fitch catalog. And then there is Drew Patterson. I have been secretly in love with him since seventh grade. All I wanted was for him to just simply acknowledge me. To just say my name. But for that to happen, for me to finish this march through hell they called high school and go out with style, I needed skills. I needed my Excalibur. Information is power. The video phone. With such a weapon in hand, I might just have a chance at becoming a somebody. There's just one hideous criminal mastermind standing in my way. Mandy, 722. Gonna be late. My mom died when I was four. And even though he loves me, Dad had issues about letting go. You wanna make some kind of noise so I know you're all right? <coughs> yeah, thanks. It's your uh, birthday tomorrow, isn't it? Yeah. And I've got a few surprises up my sleeve. seriously need a new phone. I, I can't even begin to scheme or spy or conspire like everyone else. It's such a burn. I'm in high school. I need survival skills. Kitten, I, I am socially handicapped with this relic. can't even send or receive pictures or video. And can you possibly stop calling me Kitten? What? I'm gonna be 18 years, not months. Okay? I'm gonna say Hello? Andy? Hi, Anne. Have you seen Drew yet? No, not yet. Oh, he must have been a great warrior or a king in a past lifetime. I could write a thousand songs about him and I'd just be scratching the surface. Mandy? He's right behind you. What's up, Drew? Good morning, Drew. Hey there. Check it out. It's kind of cute in a pathetic way. Poor thing. Salivating over my Drew. So sad. Knowing her whole life, she'll never know, punk. You're mine. That. Oh. Why didn't I think of it? <laughs> Check it out. Granny panties up ahead. This is Lisa Cross reporting live for the Fashion Challenge. <laughs> nice girl, Granny. <laughs> Cruelty 
knows no bounds. Your ass is on every phone in school. Forget about him, Mandy. He's not only dating the Antichrist, but he's upper crust, and we are trying to claw our way up to the middle class. He lives in a gated community, and we live in a dated community. Mandy, are you even listening to me? I don't care what you guys say. I'm gonna get you to notice me. That's your plan to get the Adonis of high school to notice you? Oh, you look like a whole new species. Maybe someone from the Discovery Channel will notice you. Okay, the boys practice after six period in pool one, the girls pool two. It's at least a shot. Oh! <laughs> I think you actually enjoy being a klutz because you know how much happiness it brings to others. <laughs> Mandy. Mandy. My name.